Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Will's Cartomancy Tarot. As promised, I said I will be discussing um, Donald Trump's impeachment inquiry, um, part B. And so with this reading, ladies and gentlemen, what I like to do is to go on and just, you know, see what is to be expected with this um, a peach impeachment trial and to see whether, in fact, Donald Trump will be able to remain as president or will he be Austin, okay? So I've decided to go on and use my Russian Gypsy deck as I used on part A. And so I've already shuffled, as we see here, and I already put together the pictures that I see that are, are kind of showing here in his reading. And ladies and gentlemen, many of the pictures here, you know, have not changed since the last reading. So let's go on and get started here. And if this reading resonates, um, or if you like this reading, go on and just give it a big thumbs up. If you've yet to subscribe to my channel, please take a few moments to do so now. Okay, let's go on and get started here, okay? Let's start with this first symbol, okay? And ladies and gentlemen, just to just re-explain again, you know, um, with doing this reading, um, basically what you one would need to do is to just to, to put the symbols together and then depending on the orientation of um, of how the symbol falls determines the interpretation, okay? So let's go on and get back started with this reading and start with the first symbol. We have the heart symbol there, and that falls in position four, ladies and gentlemen. So that shows that, you know, Trump seems to be in agreement, you know, with close people. And we have to say here that it's more than likely with the Republicans, you know? And this card is really all about you know, friends that that's really supporting you in this issue. So it shows that his family and friends and certainly the Republicans are certainly supporting him um, with what's kind of going on. And, you know, they don't see that he should be removed. OK, let's look at the next symbol here. We have that owl um, symbol there. And this symbol also um, appears in position four and this card is all or symbols all about problems with projects you know and it shows that things will not go as as he expect you know and it shows a change or idea that he wants to kind of make it doesn't seem like it's going to come about and of course these are maybe personal things that are going through because these this is in fact his personal reading okay the next symbol we have here we have that ship card there and that falls in position two and that card is all about or symbol is all about you know finances and adventure and experience so it seems like he's going to either be you know selling something or kind of making money that i'm kind of seeing that kind of comes across and of course it may be within his own um legitimate businesses okay and then we have that demon um symbol there and that falls in position two and that shows a lot of inner conflicts and a lot of negative thoughts you know, usually within the subconscious, you know, um, it shows that, you know, because of what's going on, he really does want to strike back, you know, and this card is all about, you know, yielding to the temptation of kind of taking vengeance for an offense, you know, and if he does kind of strike back, you know, against people that's trying to impeach him, it's only going to kind of increase the unpleasantness that's really um, kind of surrounding him already. You know, so this card is kind of urging Trump to kind of somewhat turn the other cheek and, you know, um, and just go through this process. OK, our next symbol here that we have here and, you know, just to just take a step back, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling that, you know, he'll find that, you know, he needs to really control himself because he has taken a very dispense defensive type stance with that symbol. And it certainly shows that you know, he'll indeed be involved in this impeachment controversy, controversial issue, which, you know, I feel that he's going to kind of take offense to the stance that the Democrats, um, you know, have been taking, you know, with, of course, finger pointing and, and name calling. That's why that's kind of tempting him to kind of take revenge in some sense. And it's kind of warning Trump that, you know, that he needs to kind of cool down a bit because his action, once again, will only lead to, you know, some form of, you know, unpleasantness that I'm kind of feeling here, okay? 
Next we have, let's look at the book symbol here that we have in that reading, okay? And in, in, in this reading. And this is all about secret news or communication of a secret um, type. You know, so it looks like during this trial or prior to this trial, someone looks like it's they're going to give Trump an edge perhaps to a secret that will benefit perhaps him in this situation. I'm kind of feeling that it might even potentially even be a woman that I'm kind of showing here. That's kind of showing there in that in your in the last card there when we symbolize that. I'm feeling some type of secret that he's going to kind of gain an edge. OK. And then we have this road, okay, symbol there, okay? And that falls in position three. So it shows, or it's all about a path in life. So the road ahead, you know, for Trump, it certainly falling in this position is not going to be smooth, you know? I feel that he's going to, you know, become bored or he's becoming very bored with, you know, this president job and feeling a bit dissatisfied or will feel a bit dissatisfied, okay? And I'm feeling that he's going to be really contemplating really doing something differently. I'm kind of feeling yeah, or kind of getting here, okay, with this, okay? And then your next symbol here, we have that, that house symbol. And, you know, ladies and gentlemen, this is all about, you know, household or business affairs. And this is, you know, is kind of suggesting that someone is really around him really that he's trying to block his plan or it's attempting to block his plan um and it shows that someone is certainly out there to harm him i feel that his life is in is in jeopardy when when i'm kind of receiving this symbol and he needs to be very 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 careful okay and then you know just moving on to the next symbol here we i'm kind of i i see the 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 heron symbol here and that is all about new beginnings and it's all about an addition so it shows that maybe some type of unexpected changes or a new entry of a child or something or a relative kind of came into you know trump's life but again this is his own personal reading so a lot of these things you know may not be relevant to the impeachment hearing but they're just falling in his reading okay and just wanted to synthesize everything here by just looking at your last this last card here. You know, he has the horse, okay? And falling, you know, this symbol is all about emotional upheaval. So I'm feeling that he certainly is going to experience a traumatic event, you know? And I feel that this event might, in fact, you know, cause him to, to, to experience some type of suffering. You know, and this symbol is also showing that assassination and, and, you know, just as with the last reading, you know, so I wasn't sure that it was going to actually happen to Trump himself. But as we have seen from the news, it certainly happened to that, um, um, that Iran um, general there. Okay. And it does certainly suggest that retaliation is certainly highly possible and they're really going to be after Trump, I'm kind of feeling. Okay. So I feel that. He really better be very, very careful, you know, when you're seeing this card here, okay? And, guys, he also have the bread symbol there, but, and that card is all about happiness. So, I feel that he's going to receive some type of um, surprise or maybe some surprising twist might be um, ahead with regards to this. And then we have this da dagger um, here, okay? And that's all about hidden assaults, you know, but because it falls, in a very prominent position, I feel that he certainly is going to be protected in time. And I feel that someone still would try to kind of hurt him, I'm feeling. And, you know, but I feel that people surrounding him, perhaps, you know, the security, they're going to really help him. And I feel that as a result, with this lady also being here that's kind of extending and helping hand, for some reason, guys, I just feel that Trump... I don't feel that he's going to be ousted, okay? This is a very um, hard one to really call. And so I decided to just to utilize two additional cards to just um, get more understanding as to whether he's going to be, in fact, ousted here. So I shuffled um, the regular cards here, and it shows that with the bottom card here being the two of spades, it shows that the Democrats and the Republicans seems to be, they're going to be in a very deadlock or stalemated 
type situation with no winners here I'm kind of feeling okay it, there's gonna be delays after delays and I'm feeling as a result with selecting this card here Trump isn't in fact going to be Austin I think that there may be some penalties or some things that he may be disciplined um, for but I don't really feel that he's going to be Austin. So ladies and gentlemen, this is what I have into the impeachment hearing um, or impeachment trial that is set to come up. And if this reading um, resonates with you guys, or if you like it, go on and just give it a big thumbs up. And if you've yet to subscribe, please take a few moments to do so now. Thanks a lot for your time and enjoy your day.